Eves, Eves, you want to say something? From here. Mm. I'm here. What's up guys? So we're here in China. This is Changsha University of Science and Technology and those ones they are my classmates. We have a news for you guys. We know that you already back home overseas. Then you want some advice from us. You want to know what is going on in China right now since you guys went back home and the borders to close it. Then I'm asking them, they'll give you some information some ideas and opinions what they think you guys should do then i will start from you my friend you can introduce yourself of a... name is ayu mustafa yeah i'm studying computer science here in changsha university yes. of science and technology yes and so he's doing computer science this is changsha university of science and technology so for you are you uh, what can you say to those people who went back home yeah. And since they know we in China and they expect from us at least some advice or some information, what is going on in China? Honestly, considering information, bro, we can't do anything about that because yeah. it's like China, it's like China government are the one who's gonna issue these orders about opening the borders. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So even if you want to ask about it, yeah, you won't get any results. And result. So they, they should be patient, waiting. They should, they should be patient. You know, in life, there are things that you can't control. And there are things that you cannot control. Yeah. So focus only on the things that you can control in order for you to feel good about yourself. No, that's but, true. But like, if you have a problems, you know, this China border thing, you already maybe like failed in your in last year and the school is asking you to pay and you don't know where it, like yeah, a lot of things, yeah, man, bro, it can yeah. happen, you know? I really understand, I really understand. Yeah. So we have here, uh, I want to listen to you guys more opinions. Ask, so uh, what can you what can you say to those people? Because it's really hard. One, oh, almost one year, they went back home. The borders still closed. And some of them, they, they want to commit suicide. They, wanna, they just want to quit the school. Because yeah. it's really hard waiting for almost one year. And they don't know what they can do. So what do you, what can you advise them? Mm, yeah, first, um, I'm Danza Francisco yeah. uh, from Rwanda. Mm -hmm. uh, the thing I can say is that, uh, you know, we all need a good thing to us. Yeah. Uh, the guys who back in their country, they go because they want good things because we were in bad situation, in danger. So uh -huh. if you, you was looking for a good thing, yeah. Man, there's no need to give up. Just keep looking for good. Yeah. Even if the border is still closed, but if you open and the study will continue as you you just saw. Yeah, just be don't patient. Have to give don't up. give up, yeah. yeah. Don't give up, be patient guys, because we in China, you guys don't deserve it. And we're not lucky. We can guys you can't call us like you guys you are lucky because you're still in China, you're still able to do your, your major like studying and you guys you can't i know a lot of you guys were having a lot of problems like studying online attending online classes is really hard because many of you guys you don't have internet you don't have even computer but it is what it is this is a time that everybody's facing difficult trouble like situation problems so i just recommend you guys to be patient the borders will be open very soon yeah. so what you what you you have to say so, to them so my name is Lord I can't Yeah, you can Rwanda. speak up please, so just to yeah, let them know. Okay. Okay. So I'm doing new energy. Mm -hmm. So the advice I can give to those guys, you know, it's not easy to stay at home, yeah. studying every day. So it's not easy. Maybe they can keep studying like online, those classes. They still take the videos yeah. in the class and they post on YouTube. Maybe you can see <coughs> studying on YouTube. Then you do, you do those assignments, so maybe if they open the borders, you come back. Yeah. So Instead keep of being quick. patient, so don't quick, so keep doing those assignments, talking to the office, maybe continue to talk to the Laoshi's inboxes, yeah. so maybe the problem will be solved, maybe solved. Yeah. So be patient. Be patient, because you guys you must be patient. Get in touch with your managed school, your school manager, if you're a student. If you're a worker and you're still waiting for the company to send you another JW. Yeah, yes. Mm -hmm. If you're waiting for this document to come back to China, whether they reopen the border for a specific type of visa, 
You just gotta be patient because we can't do nothing. We in China and the government must decide. So we're still waiting. And this moment I know will come. It's very soon, it's very soon. But the bad news for you guys, the coronavirus cases like situation, this pandemic is getting worse again. The numbers of, of COVID-19 cases is, are increasing now. So I hope you guys can just be patient and wait. So you to summarize like what you have to, what you had, can say to them, like what you? Uh, I think so, just wait. You will, the people go back and come yeah. home. Yeah. I think so, be patient. Be patient. Be patient. Yeah, that's all. Yeah, that's all. That's all, be patient guys, because in life there are moments that we will have, uh, we have to face problems, we will face uh, a lot of pressure, but nothing is lost. We still got time. You guys, you still got time. Just be patient. If you have question, any question you want to ask to us, just leave in the comment section. We, we can make another video and explain and talk to you guys. Give you guys more advice. And that's all for this video. Thank you for watching. Are we still here? Anytime soon, anytime soon, things will be good. We are doing this now, huh? Yeah, I'm coming. Still degrees, it's really hard.